So seeing as I've just taken these out of the wash, I thought I'd take a moment to show you my road skin jeans. So I've only been riding three years, and this, these were the jeans I bought before I started riding, uh, when I was learning. I did my direct access course, I got these um, from the NEC uh, Bike Live show. And they measured me up there on the day, they took an order, and I think I had them within a week or something after the show. Um, I can't remember exactly how much I paid. It was about 150 quid, something like that, 160. These are the Elite jeans. Uh, I got the optional Elite armor. So this is quite a hard armor. Uh, they do a softer one now that's still CE2. Um, <clears throat> knees and hips. Um, as you can hopefully see, three years wear, they are in really good condition. Uh, I did have to have them taken up, even though I was measured, uh, they were still a bit long, so uh, somebody took them up for me, uh, which probably needs redoing because the stitching's coming undone. Not rose skin's fault. Um, there's a couple of light marks where things have worn. Underneath here, I can feel it, is the Velcro, which holds the pocket on for the knee armour. Uh, that one's worn a bit. You've just got the beginnings of a mark there. I must stress, this is three years wear. Um, they've not been worn every day. <clears throat> I would say probably throughout spring, summer, autumn. It's probably every other day. Certainly pretty much most weekends. And they get ridden <clears throat> all day. Um, I mean, you don't wash them probably as often as you would a real pair of jeans. They're not really jeans. They look like jeans. This is protective motorcycle clothing. Uh, obviously, you reduce its effectiveness every time you wash them. Um, certainly these would have been waterproof when I first got them they won't be now, they'll need reproofing um, but to be honest I don't really ride in the rain and I've got some waterproofs for when I do um, let's have a quick look at the back you can see seat on them still absolutely fine stitching's all absolutely spot on I mean obviously you do a lot of sliding around on a bike going around corners and stuff um, you wouldn't know, you really wouldn't know. Um, got these lovely um, elasticated edges, so you know you get a really good fit. Um, and even with the armour in, I mean they are heavy. These are fully lined uh, jeans, so they are quite heavy. Um, but once you got them on, you don't you don't notice. You really don't notice. Uh, if you give me a sec, I'm just gonna flip them, and you can see the uh, the lining on the inside. So here's the inside, uh, so you've got pretty big pockets for, for wallets and mobile phones and stuff. That's the pocket for the hip armour, which is there, fits in that nicely. Uh, you've got the knee armour pockets, as I said earlier there's velcro for these, holding these on. The velcro is sewn to the liner, not to the jean, so from the outside of the jean, as you saw in the previous take, um, you wouldn't really know these were bike jeans. There's no, there's not, you know, you don't have this stitching going across the knees that a lot of them have, you know, understandably to reinforce this area. Uh, Rose skin seems to get away with it by just uh, um, attaching it to the lining because they are fully lined and it's, you know, it's it's sewn in. It's part of the stitching. I mean, look at that stitching. This lining is is part of this jean. Uh, it's there's no there's no movement. It's it's absolutely an integral piece of what is it's PPE it's it's protective personally protective equipment the lining goes all the way down doesn't stop until you know a couple of inches from the bottom uh, obviously your boots are coming up to here anyway if you've got ankle boots then yeah you, you might get a grazed ankle I mean I, I don't know how many jeans there are out there that are fully lined to this this level um, and this is Dyneema as well so it's it's one up from the usual Kevlar it's it's tough stuff. Um, I'm not fortunately. I've not had a slide uh, with these on. I um, mean, it's fabric, so you wouldn't slide very well. But you know, if you did slide, um, <clears throat> you can go a very long way on these. You have a look on YouTube. Rose Skin have literally they've taken a belt sander to these. They've uh, <laughs> there's a video where he's getting dragged down a racetrack on his ass. Uh, yeah, it wears through, but it it saves your skin. Um, absolutely great jeans and as i said i've had them three years i'm probably at the point where i want to get another pair more so i think i'm about to do a tour of italy um and i think these will be a little bit thick 
for Italy, I might get a little bit worn, so I'm contemplating getting um, a lighter pair because they do three or four different grades now. Um, obviously, you, you lose some of the protection. I mean, these are the Elite Jean, so they're fully lined, fully protected, the best protection at the time you could get. They do have another one now, I think it's called Paranoid or something like that, um, that I think Scott, as I understand it, it's, it's either replaced this model or is even better than this model. Um, if if that can even be a thing, um, but yeah, great great jeans. My next uh, set of jeans will will be road skin, uh, and I I can't see that changing because you can't go wrong at the price. They're they're just the same price as everyone else, but you get fully lined. Other products at this price, they're not fully lined. It's like you know tops of your legs and your ass. You know where you need it, but it's not full. You know it, this is fully lined. It's an integral part. It it makes the whole trouser stronger uh, and gives you more protection um so yeah that that's about as evangelical as i can get about <laughs> a pair of jeans but they really are good i just yeah I, like i say i just i just had them out to wash them and i thought you know what i'm going to tell people about these because uh, these guys really need really need praise for doing a great jean they could have taken the mickey with the price they could have charged twice as much uh and they didn't as you can see made in england um Great, great product. I really recommend them. So, next time you're out buying jeans, give these guys uh, a look up. You won't find them in shops. You'll see them at the NEC. Uh, you will find their website online. Uh, just Google Roadskin. They should come straight up. Um, but absolutely buy with confidence. Three years. Three years. Cheers, guys. Thanks for watching. <laughs>